Essay on Duties of a Student Student life is a temporary period of man's life, but it is of vital importance. It is the time when the seed of future prosperity and happiness is to be sown. As he will sow at this stage of life, so will be reaping in his later life. Therefore, an ideal student is to cultivate all the good qualities of a man during this time in order to build a happy and prosperous life. The first duty of an ideal student is to study. Learning with an ideal student is a jealous mistress. As Mr. Halden points out, the students constitute a class by themselves. Great responsibilities on them, his parents need not good him. He takes up his studies with all seriousness. He does not allow any other activity to disturb or to distract him. An ideal student does not waste his time and energy on trash. He seeks the teacher's guidance. He has faith in the superior knowledge of his teachers. An ideal student is not a bookworm. He is keep but not blind. He selects his reading wisely. He has well-defined tastes and he develops them with patience and care. Constant and unbroken reading makes a person dull. It also affects one's health. So an ideal student is interested in games and sports. He may not be an excellent player of any games. But he has enthusiasm for playing. If he cannot play he at least participates as a spectator. Besides games there are other general activities at a college. An ideal student participates in as many of these activities as possible. He picks and chooses according to his taste. An intelligent interest in studies, wide but systematic reading interest in extracurricular activities, general knowledge, simplicity and grace. These are some of the most important qualities of an ideal student. Charm. Old values of life are in decline. When I was a kid, the city of your city name then was really for peaceful, clean and less crowded than it is now. It is expanding by leaps and bound. All around the proper city, we find suburban localities sprouting without an end. Fashionable plazas and squares have sprung up at every nook and corner of the city. Individuals have also built thousands of small and big buildings for themselves. In your city name, we find large crowd everywhere. City buzzers look like colorful fairs. It would not be unfair to say that your city name has turned into a city of shopping centers. Your city name is in fact a city of problems. People face a host of problems at every step. Transport is so pressing that it affects everyone. Your city name is a cosmopolitan city. Here one may find people from all parts of your country name. The city presents a composite picture of a real your country name as culture. Many foreigners also visit this city. In short, life is your city name is fully of glamour and glamour. Subscribe my channel English Essay by Alexandra Daudario.